Once upon a time, a girl and a guy met. A couple years later, I happened. During the infancy stage, I learned to trust and rely on my caregiver, aka my wonderful mother, for all my basic needs and affection, which is probably the reason why I ended up being a total mommy's girl. This stage is based on trust and mistrust. This happens within the first two years. In the early childhood stage, we learn autonomy versus shame and doubt. In this stage, I develop some physical control, which helped me not only learn how to walk, but to master it. I also started to develop my own personality and become more aware of my likes and dislikes. The next stage is the preschool stage. It occurs during ages 4 to 5. During this stage, I understood right from wrong. At this time, I was learning how to take initiative and started trying some of my interests such as soccer, drawing, and swimming. Next we have the school years, which takes place during ages 6 to 12. In this stage, we learn about industry versus inferiority. During this stage, I started to realize that I was different from everyone else. I tried to be the best I could be in everything I did. During these years, I became more active in school. Here we have the adolescent stage, which is from age 13 to 18. We face identity versus role confusion in this stage. During this stage, I learned about the different social roles that I must fulfill, such as family, friends, and sports. In this stage, I struggled a bit with identity. I wanted to try different things while my parents expected me to be a certain way. That caused some role confusion. In high school, I was in student council and was voted most spirited. One main accomplishment during this stage was graduating high school. And next, we have early adulthood, which takes place 19 years to 40. In this stage, we will face intimacy versus isolation. Starting early adulthood was great. I had just graduated high school and was starting college. Shortly after I turned 20, I was diagnosed with Hodgkin's lymphoma. Because of that, I started to isolate myself. I struggled trying to figure out who I was and what I wanted to do in life. Thanks to modern medicine, I eventually got better physically and was able to defeat the disease. And thank you to my family and friends for the love and constant support. Because of them, I am now in a better state mentally and am now more aware of the person I want to be. I 
I am currently working towards living a happier and healthier life and doing everything I can to achieve my goals.